Ailey and I want to say thanks so much to our patrons. We really appreciate your support in helping make Elder Dragon hijinks a thing that will continue for as long as we can play Casual Ridiculous Commander. Thanks again, patrons. If you're like me and leave your Christmas shopping to the last minute, chances are you'll be surfing the net at the 11th hour looking for that perfect present. Listen, no judgment here. I do it too. And when I do, I know whatever rabbit hole I go down to find that ultra rare limited edition collector's item, Surfshark VPN has my back. I don't have to worry about my personal information getting stolen as it prevents pop-ups and ads and can tell me if my credit card details have been used elsewhere. It reminds me to change my passwords regularly and whatever I do online is encrypted. It's also super handy if you're visiting your family in another country and really need to keep up with your favorite series. Surfshark can have you anywhere in the world in an instant. So if that sounds like a perfect gift for yourself this holiday season, you can get two years of Surfshark at 85% off plus an extra three months for free. Just scan the QR code or click the link in the description below to sign up using our code ELDER until December 31st. And if you're unhappy with the service for whatever reason, Surfshark has a 30-day money-back guarantee. Go sign up. Happy Surfsharking. Elder Dragon Hijinx is proudly sponsored by Cool Stuff Inc. Check them out and use code aliasv to get 5% off your order. For our Canadian viewers, check out face-to-face -face games for your singles and sealed product and be sure to use code aliasv at checkout for 5% off. We're also sponsored by our friends at Moxfield.com, the best deck building site on the internet for your Magic the Gathering collection. The show is also made possible by EDH Rec and their sister site, Commander's Herald. EDH Rec is one of the best resources you can have as a Commander player. Commander's Herald is their article-focused site for Commander, where you can find more content, more insight, and some fun articles along the way. Another awesome sponsor is UltraPro. For all your accessory needs, visit ultrapro.com forward slash alias V. Don't forget code alias V at checkout for 5% off. Last but not least, thanks to our sponsor, Alter Sleeves. You can find them at altersleeves.com. Get amazing art upgrades for your cards and for your decks to personalize them as you like. And everybody, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be skulls because today we have a very special episode of hijinks just for you. I'm Ailey. Hi. Yeah. Hi, I'm Olivia. We have brought back some friends and a roommate, at least of mine. Brian Kibler is here and Ben Brode from Second Dinner and you know, just general nerd fame, I guess. Yeah, you yeah. know, like he's he's yeah. a pretty big deal. And uh this episode is actually Ben Brode's fault slash doing. Because he decided, hey, you know what? We should do an all gruel episode. And the reason I said skulls are going to be cracking is because, well, we're all gruel. All of us. All of us. Yes. And Olivia's just like, I don't want this. Where are my artifacts? <laughs> Basically, listen. <laughs> simple, simple woman. <laughs> yep. Just give me artifacts. Let me tinker. And I am happy. It's just me, on the other I'm hand, doing. though. Hell yeah. Let's go smash some <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is a special episode for another reason. This is also our 50th episode, Woo! and we have a cool little thing that we've got going. Ailey, do you want to? Yeah. You know? We're also giving away $50 gift cards to Cool Stuff Inc., one of our awesome, awesome sponsors. So thank you very much to them. And thank you to you guys as well for watching for 50 episodes. Like, Seriously, thank you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's so sweet. That's it also dope. means we're two episodes away from our birthday. Ha! Cool. So give us, give us birthday presents. Like, subscribe, and share. <laughs> Okay. It's true, though. That's that's a great <laughs> gift. Thanks. <laughs> uh, enough talking, though. Let's go smash some stuff. Let's meet the players and check out their decks. Hey, everyone. I am Brian Kibler, and I am a big girl fan in general. Uh, today, I am playing Rurik Thar, the Unbowed. Uh, my deck is basically all creatures and uh, stuff that cares about creatures, because, well, I want to attack with creatures. So let's see how it goes. What up? It's Ben Brode, a uh, hater of commander damage, and I'm uh, here today playing Rada, Heart of Keld. I'm playing a lot of fun uh, ramp spells, and uh, I'm looking forward to a merry gruelmas uh, for everyone. Today for Gruelness, I am playing Faldorn, the only Gruel deck I have. The pre-con straight out of the box, but I will play it correctly this time, i.e. not with a background on a commander that does not let you choose a background. Happy Gruula Days, everybody! Today I'm playing my favorite Gruul gal, Svella! The Ice Shaper. 
I've souped it up a little bit. I've basically gone and taken my stock car body and put some NOS in there, some spoilers. I gave it a new rim and now it bounces. Yeah, I basically just dumped a bunch of powerful cards in here because I want to beat Brian Kibler up. Are we playing Upside with commander damage? What are we doing here? Ben what are we doing? Road. Roll the yes, you are. I need to make it a condition of my uh, uh, participation in the future. Yeah. I mean, uh, I will only... it is Christmas in a few days, so you know we we could we could gift him. <laughs> if you're gonna kill him with commander damage, it has to be him dead. <laughs> uh, you're not allowed to count my commander damage. How's I'm that? I'm welcome. Not I'm, to. I'm happy to give Ben a gift for okay. Christmas. Yeah. All right, we'll I, give I, Ben I, a I, gift. I will attack you, and you will not die. All right, that's my. There you that's go. My... That's fair. <laughs> Our gift to you. <laughs> Think about the the poor audience that has to track so many sources of commander damage. Are you, calling, are you saying our audience is incapable of managing four I'm numbers? Saying humans are incapable. <laughs> I'm incapable. Well, that doesn't say much. Ben, <laughs> <laughs> you gave that to me. I had to take it. <laughs> I got a twelve. Anyone get higher than that? Not me. Oh, four. So. No. I think you're starting. Go. go for it. <laughs> I'm going to kick things off with this incredibly intimidating forest pass. We might see a lot of those in this game. Yeah. Stomping ground. Go. Oop. Show off. It's a forest and a mountain. Beat that. Forest. <laughs> go. I will draw. Ailey, are, are you going to gonna keep us from, from being the worst gruel players in the world that none of us had a turn one mana creature? Well, it's a soul ring. Is that there fine? There you go. Okay. That's actually like not even a, a, a meta creature though. That's better, <laughs> but it's still kind of ruining the theme. <laughs> I would actually like to change my land. I'm going to be boring and play a forest as well. <clears throat> boring? You mean the best. There we go. <laughs> yes. Great. Mountain revisits pass. Aha. There we go. Now we're grueling. <laughs> Ramp gang, ramp gang, ramp gang, Ooh. ramp gang! <laughs> Four. I'm going to play Layer of the Hydra. It doesn't enter the battlefield tap because I don't have very many lands yet. And I'm going to play Nexos. Nexos says basic lands you control have tap and two colorless. Send this mana only on costs that can Whoa. play X. Okay, cool. And I pass. All right. I will draw. Boom! Forest, I'm done. On tap. Draw. Like the slowest <sighs> draw in the history of Rurik. Yeah, this is yeah. not you. Something's wrong. I'm basking in it right now. I was, I was, yeah. try, I was Who trying. Forced? <laughs> I was trying to cheat and you know get my Arbor Elf in my opening hand before, but <laughs> it's true. <laughs> but, but I caught myself. <laughs> Two, three, four. I am going to harmonize and draw three cards. Whoa, that's me. Okay. I do find it kind of funny that Harmonize was originally printed as like a, a like reality shifted, you know, whatever future site concentrate, uh, mm -hmm. and now it's been printed unfold times more than concentrate. I have two or more basics. I'll play Cinderglade. Let's get wild. Dama's reach. My Much ramping. Let, what am I supposed? Isn't that what you're supposed to do with green? No, you are you are you are doing it correctly. I'm not. I'm the okay. failure of a green mage over here with just two forests in play. Finally! <laughs> All right. Uh, I won't be able to do anything after that, so I'll call it there. Fun, fun, lands. I'm gonna play my first basic land here. Oh, that's so pretty. And then this is actually, I think, my only deck that doesn't play that forest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I noticed, yeah. I was like, what's going on with those forests over there? This one's by uh, Zendikar lands. Okay, I'm going to do this. I'm going to play Clothis, God <gasps> of Destiny. Oh, I love that card. Oh, she's so good. And, yeah, she's pretty uh, sweet. I, I can attack someone. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to attack Ailey. Sure. I will take two. damage. Pass. All right, I will draw. I will play Command Tower. Hello. Non forest land. I'll play Gwenna Eyes of Gaia. So that two, three for three, she can tap for two mana in any combination of colors to cast creature spells or activate creature abilities. When you cast a creature spell with power five or greater, put a plus one, plus one counter on her and untap her. Oh, nice. Wow. She's sick. I got and that for you. Done. You're welcome. It's true. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, that's a Brothers War card. Mm -hmm. It is. Sick. I think you had it in something in like Salt Lake City, and I was like, ah, yep. yoink. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I'll take this. Uh, mine. Mountain. 
Arcane Signet. Battle Mage's Braces. Equipped creature has Haste. Whenever an ability of an equipped creature is activated, if it isn't a mana ability, I can pay one and then copy it. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh. That's me. I will play a forest. Man, ramping. It's so fun. <laughs> Do I ramp again? I think so. I mean, so. why not? There's no creatures on the board <laughs> yet. It's always the right answer. <laughs> I'm gonna Terra Morph. <laughs> and then I will also play an enchantment. Passionate Archaeologist. Commander creatures I own have whenever you cast a spell from exile, this creature deals damage equal to that spell's mana value to target opponent. Ooh, nice. So I will Terra Morph. I'll search for a basic, put it on the battlefield, then shuffle, and I'll rebound it at the beginning of my next upkeep. All right, here we go. Let's exile Harmonize. Is exiled. Uh, I gain two life and deal two damage to each opponent. I'm going to attack Ailey again. Okay. Another two. And then I'm going to play Harmonize. <laughs> oh, you, I see. Just wow. Harmonize exile. Jealousy, huh? Yeah. Only one person gets to Harmonize. <laughs> All right. I will play a forest. And then here, if, if people want to... Start harmonizing and giving everyone else cards, too. <laughs> Heartwood Storyteller. Whenever a player plays a non-creature spell, each of that player's opponents may draw a card. Ooh. Wow. It's Christmas. I, you see, we're giving. Yeah. Everyone's getting presents. I'm not giving away any, because I have like basically no non-creature spells in my entire deck. Uh, speaking of, of cards that want a lot of creatures, Circle of Dreams Druid. So it taps for green for each creature I control. Basically, a guy's cradle creature. Lovely. And then I'm done. Cool. On tap. Eldra. Let's go Crag Crown Pathway. I will cast Svella. I almost always forget about my commander when I play commander. <laughs> that's why you don't like commander damage. Because you never play exactly, commander. That's and you're it. just you like, oh god, this this mechanic is so is so bad because I never have a commander in play. He forgets yeah. that he's got a you weapon were... at his fingertips, and so now he gets salty. He's like, well, commander damage shouldn't count because I forget it all the time. <laughs> that's the Asterisk after Listen, your here. whole commander damage. Man was just talking about how companion is such a broken mechanic. It's the same mechanic. It's this is companion, right? <laughs> yeah. It's just <laughs> Ben, I want to tell you something about arbitrary rules when people feel yes. like that. I'm I'll smacking Ben for two damage. A set of arbitrary rules. <laughs> Well, yeah, yes, it's all arbitrary. Somebody came up with Magic the Gathering arbitrarily, but that doesn't mean that, like, so when we <laughs> like, have a format, damage that on has the a set. should exist, you know? Like, we, when we, we have, have to, a like, format have... that was community made and not designed <laughs> in, and decided, you know what, maybe it would be fun to play with this restriction. You have this card that's set aside, you can bring in, however, it's part of your deck. Yeah, it listen, decides. Commander is, Commander is a fun format, and that's a good restriction to add a command to your commander deck, but uh, you know, it's just like, we could add just random stuff. We could just say like, oh, what if? Uh, you know what, Ben, feel free to make your own format. Go for it, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Have the best I will. time. I but will. You're gonna make commander and it's gonna have blackjack and hookers. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I'm done, that's, by the way. That's what Ben's is known for, right? <laughs> like, what? Fine, I'll make my own format. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, Terramorph. <gasps> Wait. Oh yeah, I can't. Oh, if Faldorn was out, that would have been smart. Oh well. Man. Should we add more arbitrary rules to Commander? Is it, is it, we try not uh, to. Yeah. But, but why? Sure. But why? Why not? You can you can, have only, a you can only attack someone who does not have a dog on their on the board. Belly belly. I have two dogs, so you can't attack me, Brian. Aha. But your your dog is not in play. They're in Belt I live in too. Ellie's right here, you know, but she's 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 clearly in play. Oh my god. Ellie Belly. Let's see where this shuffle gets me. I don't I don't know what's going on here. What if we had a rule where if you have 40 lands in play, you win? <laughs> it would stop infinite life game combos. Ben, is that a variant you want to try out with your friends? No, you deck even I runs fully, 40 lands. I fully encourage it. <laughs> it would encourage people to play <laughs> enough land not. in their deck, right? Like, <laughs> no, but 40, no, no, because here's why. Then it makes it all very prescriptive. There's an objectively correct way to play and commander's not meant for that. You're prescribing people to uh, attack the loser uh, and focus you fire. To, you you <laughs> can, in what? When commander damage encourages <laughs> Like hitting the same person over and over again with the same commander, which I think is, is like counter. Do you, is things. that is that how you found it to be in the games that you play? Uh, mostly I found it to be irrelevant and it just makes commander more complicated. But, uh, oh, that, that 
It's rules. <laughs> of course it's common. So it's basically, you, you just want anarchy. You just want everything to just work the way that's I, advantageous I to you. Elegance. Rules be damned. I want design elegance. <laughs> <laughs> Whose turn is it? It's Olivia's. Mine, and I'm taking <laughs> it. In response to Ben's f***ery. <laughs> I'm going to play Fowler, <laughs> my commander, <laughs> a legendary you, human druid. You should attack Ben with that for 21 days. I, I just might. Uh, whenever I cast a spell from exile or a land ETBs under my control from exile, I get a 2 2 wolf token. I can pay one tap, discard, exile the top card of my library. I can play it this turn. I will then play another spell because I have ramped so okay. delightfully. Ailey, did you? What was the spell you cast this turn? Was it enchantment? Oh, I cost my commander and then equipped battle mage braces to it. Oh, but the equipment was already in play. Yeah. Okay. Your rebound actually is a spell, so. Oh, okay. There you everyone, go. everyone else draws a card from storyteller. What's the, oh, nice. what's the lore there? Is it that this this creature tells stories about the spells other people are casting? And if so, can you? Then you get inspired um, and draw. A card. Can you larp? Can you larp that out? <laughs> I'm going to play Urbrask the Hidden. Oh, Ew. Cool. Rude. What? I'm I would playing. like my creatures to come into play on tap. I'm just playing Gruul. I don't know what you want from me. Anyway, perfectly fair Gruul card. Ben has an indestructible god. Mother it's not It's not a god yet. I mean, it, oh, she did, oh, that's right. No Devo, huh? Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm going to swing my commander at Ben because uh, Urbrask gives her haste. Nice. So I'll do three. Commander damage. <laughs> wait, to ben. wait, I thought we I thought we We didn't agree we, on anything, my guy. How <laughs> 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 this sucks! This is the worst Christmas ever! Uh, I will untap. Wait a second. I Hold will. on. Oh, oh. I get to take a turn. Hold yeah, on. Yeah, that's no, that was that was the coal in your stocking was you didn't get a turn. <laughs> Olivia was you spent so much there. time. You spent so much time talking during everyone else's turn, complaining about. <laughs> I'm just trying to fill the time. Yes, because gruel games take so long. <laughs> okay, what? What is the? What's the toughness of all the creatures? What's the highest uh, toughness? I have three. I think four is the highest. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna play a rolling. Oh, I'm gonna attack. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, I'm gonna attack Ailey. Uh huh. I'll take two more. And then I'm going to rolling earthquake for four. Rude. Does that kill everything? Yeah, everyone draws a card from Hardwood Storyteller, except for Ben. <laughs> oh, I forgot Clothis. So let's let's get rid of the uh, one of your cards, Olivia. And uh, everybody take two and I gain two. I will exile Terramorph. Very rude. Uh, okay, and I guess, that's, I guess that's it for me. Pass. Well, all I was doing was trying to make some mana over here. You go and kill it. I will play Augur of Autumn. So let's look at the top card. It's not a land. I will play a mountain, and then I'm done. On top, draw. Yes, yes, my pretty. I'm gonna cast Itali Primal Storm. Whenever this attacks, exile the top card of each player's library, then you may cast any number of non-land cards exiled this way without paying their mana costs. You. This is gonna be fun. I'm gonna tap two to equip the bracers oh, no. on this friend. Oh, no. Oh, God. And I'm gonna swing at Ben for six. All right. Trigger. We reveal. Yeah. Ooh, Mount, Sunbirds mountain. invocation. Goreclaw. Ooh, a Goreclaw. Yes. Oh, I'll take them all. What did you get, Liv? Uh, Ash Barons. Can't take that. So I get Sunbirds invocation. Hell yeah. Goreclaw. And what was yours, Ben? Mountain. A mountain. All right. So I get a Goreclaw, and then she buffs stuff. Okay, cool. And then yeah, Ben, you're getting smacked for six. Donk. Ah. <laughs> oh yeah, and then Sunbird's Invocation. Whenever you cast a spell from your hand, reveal the top X cards to your library where X is that card CMC. You may cast a card reveal that is X or less without paying its mana cost and put the rest in the bottom in a random order. Nice. And that is my turn. Okie dokie. I'll untap. Uh, my love, my light is Rurik in play. No. Great. I'm in a <laughs> forest. <laughs> I'll tap a forest for a soul ring. Perfectly on curve. I will pay five for my commander. And then I will tap two, four, six. Yeah, go for it. Uh, no. That's actually all I'm going to do right now. All right, my turn? Yeah. 
All right, so I'm going to let's see, figure out my draw trigger here, or my uh, pre-combat trigger. Do I want a mana? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna blow up the land in your yard there, Ailey. Get a mana. You got it. And then Kura, the boundless sky, flying death touch. When it dies, I either get to search my library for up to three land cards and put them in my hand, or create an XX spirit creature token where X is the number of lands I control. I will play a land, two, three. Is no one doing anything about, about Ailey's, <laughs> Ailey's like, uh, Itali and? I know oh, it has something to do. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna do anything, sorry. I'm just gonna, I, I have a blocker. Uh, and then I'm gonna play Rada, Heart of Keld here, my commander. It's my turn, she has first strike, and then I can look at the top pair of my library anytime, and I can play lands with the top of my library, and then I can give her plus X plus X, where X is the number of lands I control. Yep. Pass zip turn. You know what that card is good at? Killing people with commander damage. <laughs> <laughs> not today! Uh, I guess I'm gonna have to be the person who does something here. I'm gonna <laughs> stick slime the Sunbird's invocation. Oh, nice, nice. my friends, nice. all gone. We we're counting on you. We knew you could do it. We, just didn't wanna... <laughs> we let you be the hero. We're really all that happened in this game is I played some mana creatures. You've killed them, and then I saved your ass. So <laughs> uh, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I gave everyone else some cards, I generated some mana, and then, yeah. you know, I, I stopped Ailey from just being able to play 8 million cards this turn. <laughs> Helpful. But that's no fun. Yes, it is. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm the tank here, clearly. I'm the guy standing in the fire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Going, this is fine. Goreclaw, so creature spells with power 4 cost 2 less. Thanks, Brian. Yes, right, right here, right here. <laughs> Whenever this and, attacks, uh, each creature control with power four grid, it gets plus one and trample. Lovely. What a good bear. That's a cool card. Maybe I should put it in my deck. Mm. <laughs> Maybe I should put it in mine. <laughs> Go land for turn. What are the biggest toughnesses on your boards? I get to ask this question now. Four, four. Four. Again, three. Three. You know what? Let's just keep being the problem. Five for Xenagos, god of revels. Indestructible. Mm. As long as your devotion to red and green is less than seven, it's not a critter. At the beginning of combat, another target creature control gains haste and XX at the end of turn, where X is that creature's power. XX? Wow. Okay, that's cool. My devotion's currently one, two, three. Gorklaw is uh, green? One. One green? Yeah, one green. One, two, three, four, five, six. One shy. I am going to send a Tali at Brian. And Gorklaw can go at Olivia. So it's a five, four now? Because it... Gives itself plus one, plus one, and trample. What were you, okay. what were you targeting with Xenagos? Oh, yeah, that too. Let's give it to Gorklaw. Gorklaw is now very large. So at the beginning of combat, that'll be an eight. Yeah, so it'll, it'll be a nine, nine ultimately. Yes, yeah, so it'll be nine power at Olivia, and then... Get wrecked. Seven and at they, Brian. They, they, tra they trample too. Yeah, they and then there's a trigger. Oh, Nissa! yes. I have a Wood Elf, which wood I already elf. knew about. Oh, <laughs> Cultivator okay. Colossus. Yeah. Yes. I would like the Cultivated Colossus and Nyssa, please. Yeah, there's a Wood Elf as well, so... Meh. That's, that's <laughs> Less wow, things to write. Install. Wow. <laughs> You're just like, I don't even want your card. Your card sucks. It's free. I, hope I still don't want it. I hope my gift came with the receipt, Brian. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, so Gorklaw's coming at me uh, in his halberd. Nine. What so the, the hell is wrong with you? So the, the bracers aren't like first strike or anything, right? No, no, it just gives haste. All right, I'm gonna block with the Cynic Slime. Since it has trample. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take the eight. <laughs> Nine. I'm gonna lose a creature for that. Whatever! <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna block with the Cynic Slime All and right. Death Touch here at Oh, it's Death Touch, right? That makes yeah, sense. Yeah, let's go. Uh, so in response to the blocks then, I'm gonna beast within your slime to not have that happen. Because okay. <laughs> I'm having too much fun. You get a beast, though. All right. I'm a beast. You have a beast, yeah. <sighs> and then Cultivated Colossus. Cultivated Colossus, power and toughness are each equal to the number of lands you control. When he enters the battlefield, you may put a land card from your hand onto the battlefield tapped. If you do, draw a card and repeat this process. Okay, so I should have done that on attacks, but I don't think it will have changed anything, so... I'll just resolve that now. So I will yep. put Highland Forest in, because it will come in tapped anyway. I'll 
I'll draw a card. Right, and then you could then you could do it again. Yeah, I will. Stomping ground in. I will draw a card. And then you can do it again. I cannot do it again. Ah. Drat. Good. Pay the two. Oh, Nissa's is out, so she will then once I've paid the two. Plus make my lovely forest creature with three counters on. And then I'll pay two again, so I have four green floating. I'm gonna go Gala Greeters. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield under your control, choose one that hasn't been chosen, put a counter on, create a tap treasure, gain two life. I'll do that and then use the other two for Steve! Look, I got a fancy Steve, Olivia. Look how pretty he is. No, I won't. Oh. Oh, I've made her mad. Okay. <laughs> I'm just not celebrating anything after you hit me for nine for no good reason. <laughs> Sorry? No, you're not. I thought it was less power. I didn't want to attack into Ben because he would have killed it. Anyway, so everyone knows what Steve playing does. Playing defenders. Yep. Well, I recommend playing defenders yep. if you're uh, And then worried. I have one. Trample means nothing matters, Ben. <laughs> Death touch matters. Yep, Death oh, touch matters. Oh, yeah. What happened to that uh, acidic slime? Did it kill anything? <laughs> I mean, she had to spell on it. I did. If only someone else had done something to stop all this, then maybe. <laughs> I'm going to play oh, so it so, she would so just have need, endless things. So you need other people to do your work for you? <laughs> I, I would like someone else in the game to do something, yes. Uh, That's I my turn. And then my board got wiped and... Oh, I've made a treasure. <laughs> it's tapped. It's Christmas! Where's the Christmas spirit? <laughs> I'm very joyful right now. Yeah. That's my turn. <laughs> yeah, she gave, she gave me a beast. Just what I wanted. <laughs> This is why running land is stupid. They aren't even spells. You can't do anything with them. Flooding is the worst. Lands are seriously the worst cards in Magic. What? Yeah, <laughs> I said it. I could not disagree more. I, I love lands. Yeah, but you think lands commander damage shouldn't card. be real. That's, so that's I, why the no. true Magic believers will understand. Ben, uh, I'm going to blow your mind. You don't have to play commander. <laughs> well, hold on. <laughs> Look, just, you don't, listen, if you don't like I don't, our rules, I don't normally, I don't normally get to be part of a gaming community <laughs> and get to like rage about like stuff on the internet. <laughs> normally, I'm the, I'm the ragey. You're the ragey. Uh, the rage is skeptical. <laughs> I'm taking this opportunity to experience what it feels like. You are uh, taking this opportunity to become vitriol. everything you can't stand to me. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> 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 uh, you know, no, I'm not casting anything. I'm just mad and I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Eric? Not actually mad. I'm just passing. Uh, you, it'll be really good now. If you play like a rolling earthquake, maybe for. Yeah, you know. it'd be super cool if I drew one, right? Because <laughs> obviously. Who just earthquake away my mana creatures? And now there's actual problems. <laughs> What's the biggest creature? Cultivator's 8-8 eight, eight right now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna, is there a land in the graveyard anywhere? No. Damn it! Ow, that would've been. Can anyone deal one damage to Cultivator costs? <laughs> no. Uh, well, yes. uh, if you kill this land, it goes down to a 7-7, seven, seven, so. I, I can, I oh, can yeah. deal damage. Oh, we're good. I, I can deal damage to it. I no, can we're good, either way, we're good. Okay, I'm gonna yeah. get rid of Urabrask from your graveyard. Never went okay. two, I gave two. Cool. And then I'm going to add a land, and it's time to attack, so... Oh, well, you lose you lose that mana if you don't yeah, use I'm it. I'm not going to play that. Yeah. I'm going to play that land for the top card of my deck. Yes, thank you for reminding me. I didn't get mana from Caucus. Oh, okay, never mind then. I thought you were getting mana. I chose Exiled to What kind of flying blockers you got over there, Ailey? Me? I'm a gruel deck. Yeah. I don't have flyers. True gruel uh, deck. You and your flyers. Excuse you. True <laughs> Gruel decks would run spiders with reach. What kind of defense are we looking like uh, right now on everyone's board here? What kind of like. Uh... Uh, I can't send lands to block, so. Okay, great. Okay, so here's what's going to happen uh, Ailey, mm -hmm. four damage in the air, and Brian. You, you know what? Att attack, the, attack the Nissa. The Nissa, unless you're killing it. Oh. Uh, There's a Nissa on six! <laughs> oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, thank you. Nissa. It's coming for Nissa. Yeah, this is going for Nissa. The 4-4 four, four flyer is going for Nissa. And then the 3-3 three, three is coming for, for Brian. First draw. I'll block, I'll block with my 3-3, three, because three, it's clearly going to die. Yes. It's probably going to die. Yeah, he's not going to stay around. Okay, and then I'm going to cast... Uh, it's really sad. This makes me really sad. I'm going to cast Subterranean Tremors for seven. X damage to each creature without flying. If X is four or more, destroy all artifacts. 
Oh. Uh, if X is eight or more, put an eight-eight red lizard creature token onto the battlefield. I, I missed the I missed the the second kicker by one. Wait, wait. That's funny. Oh, oh, wait! I can save my cultivated colossus. Bye, Steve. What? Quick, come on. Oh boy. How much uh, damage will be on that? It's gonna be a nine-nine with or no? Uh, uh, no, but because it, it's taking damage, so it's yeah, gonna it's have, gonna have seven. It's gonna have seven damage. It's gonna be an eight-eight. Then it's gonna be a uh, uh, or no? It's gonna be a nine-nine. Nine, 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 and the land dies. So one yeah. damage will kill it. Okay, I will. I will uh, stomp. <gasps> you wow. little. Hmm. Can I stop? Oh, please finish the thought. <laughs> I'm not even sure that kill. Uh, maybe it's better. It's probably better yeah, to kill yeah. that. Yeah, that'll, that'll, that'll kill the Nissa. it. Because you can kill the Nissa too, and I'm not sure which is scarier. I would say Nissa's probably scarier. Yeah. Especially because I can get Svela out and start mm, paying yeah, Battle Mage's braces. Yeah. And yeah, just, yeah, I, I, I think it's better to kill the Nissa. We're going to dunk the Nissa. Battle Mage's yeah, braces we'll are Nissa. dying. All the artifacts are going away. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're right, you're right. Both of your artifact okay. mana yeah, and the bracers are going to die to that. Okay. I didn't know the, what, what, what set is that card from? I've never seen that card before. I'm it's, guessing it's, it's Ixalan. Oh, it's Conspiracy. Okay, that's why I've never seen it. <laughs> it's, it's what, just, what it's just Conspiracy's great. I mean, uh, <laughs> sure. Yeah, when would you ever play it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We have a sealed box of it here at the house. If you ever want I to love try those. It. Those sets are. That's so my sealed box of conspiracy. conspiracy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I actually I did a conspiracy draft like on Sunday of a Pro Tour once, and I ended up getting that box, but I've just never opened it. Oh wait, this yes. is on an adventure. I apologize. Super dang it! Uh, my turn's over. Go ahead. Okay, I will untap. Work was done though. I yeah. will draw. I lost my auger bottom, so I don't know what the top card of my deck is. Just that. <laughs> Join the club. <laughs> I also don't know what's on top of my deck. Well, it's, I, it's, I it's relevant to me. Before I cast the spell, but I didn't, so I also don't know. <laughs> the Cold Bear is a trample? Yes. yes. And I can give a trample with. No, right. no, no, just haste. Wait, sorry. Wait, 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 wait. Just haste. Wait, wait. Oh, oh he's just indestructible. Haste. Oh, man. Yeah, he's indestructible. Yeah. Yeah. He's also just an enchantment right now. Yeah. He will not be destroyed. I'll put him um, this way, so he's having a nap. All right, well, I, I'm i going to play Domery Raid. This is why I really wanted to know what the top card my deck was. I will plus my Domery. It's a Xenagos. So Xenagos goes to my hand. I will then play Bonders Enclave and Ogre Battle Drive. So another creature enters the battlefield under my control. That creature gets plus two, plus zero, and gains haste until end of turn. Nice. And then I'm done. Now I'm out for Ben. I'm done. Girl. Maybe I shouldn't have tapped on my blocker. I thought I was clearing the board. <laughs> 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 Mistakes were made. <laughs> here comes the, here comes the damage. <sighs> this is a big, that's a big colossus. That is a big colossus. Yeah. <laughs> All right. At the beginning of combat, which I'm going to another target creature. Hello. Gains haste and plus X plus X until end of turn. Where X is that creature's power. You're five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do I want to do that rather? Well, I already moved to combat. Let me do it. I mean, you're gonna, just so you know, you're going to have no blockers next turn if you attack. I mean, it's going to be rough. I it's mean, like, does Gruul just block? Just like bonkers homies coming <laughs> away from every direction. I'm just, yeah. hey, you know. Gruul doesn't know how to block, hey. Mr. Brode. Uh, you're going to you take 16. You see Brian Sports <laughs> haste? Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> hey, take 16. <laughs> the fun part about the game, Ben, is if you're already dead, you don't have to worry about commander damage. Mm. Oh, yeah, uh, okay, yeah. It's That's a, true. It's, a, it's that thinking there. I'm going <laughs> to... Why well, get paid the zero bucks? <laughs> I'm going to recall yeah, Svela for five. Is that in the philosophy document for Commander? <laughs> <laughs> don't We're all going to die. None of this like matters. Like <laughs> <laughs> Very nihilistic view of everything. That's my turn. Go for it. All right. We agree. I hate land. Oh my god. <laughs> you're playing it as a million ramp spells, and you're like, man, I keep drawing land. Yeah, I'm supposed to get them out of the way with ramping, so I don't draw them anymore. Does it, does your commander not have a big a big payoff for for having a bunch of stuff? Discard uh, a card, exile it. No, it does not. Yeah, uh, yeah. Just so you know, Xenagos <laughs> is a bro now. He's a broad now? He's a, he, well, a, a dude guy bro oh, face. Welcome to the family. <laughs> yeah. He's welcome to come over for Christmas. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, I'll scry at least. Another land, oh my God. You know, every year for Christmas growing up, mm -hmm. my dad always got us, everyone in the family, six packs of magic cards. Aw, that's cool. And we would do a sealed deck Christmas that's awesome. Aw, that's year. really cool. How big is Cultivator Colossus now, by the way? Just eight. I missed the land drop. Okay. Unless he's attacking. 
<laughs> yeah, then you 16. 16. 16. I like this card. You know what? To hell with it. Just wish it wasn't a Pringle. Um, M secret layers. <laughs> I'm gonna tap seven. That's so much mana. Play my commander. Welcome back. And then I'm gonna Hello. Play three to cast Bone Crusher Giant out of exile. Hit alien the face for three. Mm -hmm. Boom. Oh, I deserve this With so much. The, yeah, I know. That's why I'm doing it. <laughs> and if Bone Crusher Giant ever becomes the target of a spell, it deals two damage to that spell's controller. Nice. I will not target with a spell. Also, oh. I, have, I have no spells that target anything in my entire deck. <laughs> There's that too. I'll pass. Ooh, here we go. Here we oh, go. It's so I'm tapping. frustrating. <laughs> that feels so good. Oh my goodness. I, the question is, can I survive? I guess I have a blocker now. Ben, carpe diem. What, what, what are you thinking of doing? Uh, okay, I, I, if I tell you, I just like reveal my hand. I'm not gonna do that. So well, I'm okay. Gonna, I am gonna play a forest, and then I'm gonna ramp the booty off y'all. So here, I'm gonna All put right. Boundless Realms. So, oh, uh, y'all Y'all yeah. think you were ramping, but you wasn't. This is ramp. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I go get eight lands from my deck and put them in the play. Oh, I'm oh, so boy. glad you're not playing that card that domes someone every time a land enters. He may yeah. be playing it, we just haven't seen it. True. So that, that, uh, that dragon can make a really big fellow when it dies then. Indeed. And I'm just okay. saying, I can be easily persuaded or convinced from hitting you otherwise. Just, just putting oh, it out there. like how? Like, what's, uh, what's, uh, Don't ready, like, me DoorDash? So I can kill you all the secrets. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, I forgot to trigger this. So, uh, oh, go yeah. that Nissa, I guess, and then everybody take two. Hi, Nissa. And go, go ahead, Brian. Okay. Uh, how big is your commander, Ailey? It's a 2-4. Mm. Okay. That's a wee little less. I'm going to play Duskwatch Recruiter, trigger over Battle Driver, so that gets plus two attack. And haste. I'm then going to play my Xenigo Scott of Rebels, mm -hmm. which will also get plus two attack and haste because it is a creature when it enters the battlefield. Mm -hmm. I'm now going to minus two Domi Raid, and Xenigo, who is eight power, is going to fight Cultivator Colossus. Oh! Oh, Xenigo is indestructible. He's so he doesn't die. And then that turns off my guy. God damn. Yes. My uh, friend! So I am going to... Hey, Brian, look, something did somebody about something about Ailey's book. Yeah, let me tell you <laughs> Wow, you can play I mean, so mean, hard, you convinced fair, yourself ben, to do something. Ben did most of the work. everything away. <laughs> so, I was here for that, too. <laughs> yeah. We are going to Xenagos, my... Duskwatch Recruiter. So uh, Duskwatch Recruiter is four power because of Ogre Battle Driver. Mm -hmm. um, so it gets plus four plus four. So it becomes an eight four and it's going to attack Ailey. Okay, I will not block. Sorry, eight six, but yeah. I will Take block it. with my face. And then I am done. Okay. I'm done. Dr Land for turn. What's the death trigger on your fancy bird over there? Either I can tutor for three lands, mm -hmm. put them in my hand or I can create a creature that is power and toughness equal to the number of lands I control. I can either go for the smart play or the fun play, and I am here for fun. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna activate Svella. Oh my God, I got the worst hit ever. Svella, you suck. Well, sh I guess I get a Tangled Florahedron. Thanks, eight mana for nothing. Boom. Eight mana for a mana creature, you know? Yep, 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 that tracks. Son of a dingleberry. I guess I'm in now survival mode, so. <laughs> Xenagos, give that haste so I can tap it for green. And I'm gonna cost the world's saddest Dockside Extortionist. Uh, enchantments and artifacts? <laughs> I have one. I got an enchantment here. Yeah, you got one there. I got nothing. Mine got have, blowed up. I have zero. Zero. Up. Wait, no, no, you have, you have, you've you got have, the one. Um, you've got the you got the he has, he has an enchantment, sorry. He yeah. has oh, an enchantment. Oh, enchantments. I thought you just said artifacts. Just Apologies. enchantments. Yeah, one. Yeah. So I get three treasures. Okay. All right. It's something. I got coal for Christmas, and that's my turn. <laughs> for the first time. <laughs> this is a land. Oh, thank God. Play a land. I will pay six for an Aurora Phoenix. See? A Gruel Flyer. It has Cascade. And then whenever I cast the spell with Cascade, I can return it from my graveyard to my hand. Oh, cool. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that is my first time ever seeing that card. I sell cards from the top of my library until I hit a non-land card that costs less. Four stone not, not that one. Six is not less. Mana Gorger's less. Ooh, that is less. Okay. 
then you do get a trigger from your commander for casting the Cascades Luck as it goes to exile, right? Yeah, I do. Please, have mercy on me. <laughs> Read a Ben for the YOLOs. <laughs> I didn't think that would work. For the YOLOs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy with that for now. I'm going to not attack into all the things. I'm going to pass. No, that's not very grueling. Mm. Yeah, there's, anyway. there's, there's a dark side extortionist that, that's scaring you. It's terrifying. <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't. It's just the new art. I didn't even recognize it. Oh yeah. Oh. That's that's right. the little right, right. one. Too. <laughs> Come at me, bro. I will. <laughs> I'm not your bro, guy. Uh, I'm not your guy, I'll friend. Seven at your face. I will block the biggest one, and the monkey will die. Okay, bye, monkey. That's it for me. Two, three, four, it's a five, six, bunch six, of forests. Nine. It's a lot of land. It's a little, it's a little disturbing. Yeah, and can do stuff. Mm. So that's How many cards do you have in your hand? I have six cards in my hand. Holy. I'm going to start by playing Titania Nature's Force. Oh, good. Oh. Boy. oh. New cards. This is, the new, she, this is a new one, yeah? Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, from yeah, Iron Brothers War. So well, I can play forest for my graveyard. You. And then uh, when I yeah, whenever I get a forest, I get a five three. Which oh I will. God, you I'm just gonna... have to play Titania with Titania. So, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Aren't you glad that legend rule doesn't work anymore? I know, right? <laughs> Wild. Here's my elemental five three, and then let's see. Is there some is there some BS going on somewhere? Are there any like BS things that I should deal with? Probably Brian. Especially non. What? And Olivia. <laughs> I've been dealt with. BS. I'm good. <laughs> she says. Yeah, I, I think I'm just going to get another blocker. So I'm going to play my graveyard recursion mold graph monstrosity here. Which is that one? Mold graph monstrosity is trample. When he dies, I exile it, then return two creature cards at random from my graveyard to the battlefield. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Nice. I see. That's cool. He can make it totally not random with his uh, clothes. Oh, you forgot your clothes thing. Oh, yeah. thank you. Yeah, let's uh, let's get rid of uh, dark side extortionist. I don't think I have any graveyard recursion, so. Everybody take two. I, I gained two. Mm. Here's the tricky bit. What do I what do I do with all my stuff? I guess I want a flying blocker for reasons. This guy's a creature now. Yeah. Well, this is the real deal. Okay, well that's exciting. He sure uh, is. Okay, I'll fin finish it up with a green sun zenith Ooh. here. So one, two, three, four. So I get I get to look for a four cost green creature and put it on the battlefield. Okay. I have no idea what the right thing to get is. Well, at so least I we're not all getting hoofed. That's a good yeah. thing. <laughs> yeah. I don't have that I don't have that card. I don't have that card. This guy that card's not on this deck. Oh good. <laughs> uh, you're done after that. Are you attacking or no? Yeah, uh, not attacking. You can go. Coward. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess I should should wait until you find out what you get. So yeah, okay. I'm gonna get Nalia Keenide. Oh, sweet. Okay, that one's your creatures have trample or creature spells like cast cost one, cost one less. Cast. Right, and you can and you can look at the top card and see if it's I creature. I look at the card card and if it's creature, put it in my hand. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Nice. Um, you have so many so many gigantic creatures now. This is um, gruel, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Very gruelous. There you go. Uh, I'm gonna start by taking up Domri. It is a runic armistor. Oh, nice. That card's so, so this, sweet. This is whenever yeah. an opponent activates an uh, ability of a creature or land that is not a mana ability, you may draw a card. So you should have two counters in your Hydra now, right, Olivia? Because Ben cast two spells. Oh, right, he did cast two spells, yes, thank you. I will play my runic armistor, trigger battle driver. I'll play a birds of paradise, trigger battle driver. And then I will play an ooh. Trigger Battle Driver. Oof. Oof indeed, yeah. So I'm gonna Dina Ghost my oof to make it eight power. And then these two are gonna attack Ailey. Am I dead? Yeah, it's ten. If you don't have You haven't you haven't cast anything, Halo? Me? Yeah. I, I just cast four things. <laughs> no, sorry, three, four, three like, things. Three things. It was <laughs> As my last hurrah, I don't know. Who's got enchantments up? No one, right? And one. Uh, we, and I one. got gods, we got gods. Yeah, I have a god. Yeah, okay, I won't do that because that'll just irritate Olivia. So I will die. <laughs> well, you should, just because it irritates me doesn't mean you shouldn't do it. People do things that irritate me all the time. But no, but, to do but it. then it now just, it's, why? <laughs> it would just benefit 
Brian at this point, so I will oh, not yeah. do that. All, all the reasons you should do. <laughs> they're going to kill you, so. <laughs> I did. Okay. And then I am done. That's what happens when you pop off too early. <laughs> you, you, you burn too bright, too fast. I'm going to blame Svella for this down. one. <laughs> she hit Jack I shit for me. Land. Oh, God. <laughs> It's all right. Olivia's going to win this. She's just quietly. No, I'm not. I'm just going to put like a bunch of lands out here and be like, well, at least they always hit the mana. I can't. I can't deal with this. So frustrating. Have you, uh, have you considered like escape shift? I'm, th I'm thinking about putting that in somewhere in my deck. Ben, I will find your house and beat you up. <laughs> what? What? I'm saying it helps. It helps. Here's the thing. I, let's say I am. It's no good when it's not in my hand. Yeah, right. Exactly. <laughs> True. You, well, you have a bird. You could smack a have, dome ring. I know I have a bird. That's probably what it's going to end up doing. I do have a, a potential blocker with my bird. Potential of blocker. Um, I think bird of paradise might save dome ring's life. Is it? It's attacking. Yeah. The bird is going to save dome ring's life. Okay. Weird, but okay. Why is that weird? Dome ring's awesome. Eh. He's a little scrawny guy that got eaten by like a skeleton within 30 seconds of a story starting. Yeah, and this is a bird. Yeah. <laughs> like... <laughs> it's a bird that does something, don't we? Just don't, don't we kill the cultivator Colossus with a god. And you're like, oh yeah, it doesn't do anything. Wasn't that the god that he overthrew as the leader of the gruel? Xenico's on a different plane. Oh, yeah, he was Theros, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking of Bar Bar the Bar 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 Bor Bor Gibmos. Bor Bor Gibmos. Yeah. There you go. The friend of Piving Needle. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Wait, so is that, did you, are you done there? Yeah. Ramping oh, okay. sucks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling good about it. I'm feeling really good about my ramping. But that's because you All had right. six cards in hand that weren't more land. Yeah, the harmonize really, really, uh, you know, brought the room together, much like the rug. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, so Clopus, Clopus triggers. I'm gonna uh, just take to the, the, Olivia. You could choose to get rid of whatever you like, and then right. everybody. And we shake uh, two. Ow! What do I do now? I all the stuff I can do. Rule smash. Like, you have a bunch of mana to activate your Nylea. Yes. I can also play my commander. I think I'll do that. So there's a fun, there's the commander tag. I haven't even played my work. It's been great, honestly. It's a fr breath of fresh air. Uh, <laughs> I, okay, I just had other, other stuff to do, you know? Yeah. I'm gonna play the top, I'm gonna, it's a land, so I'm gonna play it for the top of my deck here. Wow. Maze of Myth here, okay. Oh, uh, that's, that's actually and, kind of annoying. Yeah, I'm gonna reveal the top card of my deck. Uh, <laughs> Nylea. Creature card, yep, Nylea. I'm gonna draw from Runic Armasaur. Okay, so uh, I, I guess it's not a creature, so Unbound Thurshing goes to the graveyard and makes me sad because this is like one of my favorite cards in the deck. That card's so anyway. sweet. I don't even know what that does by name. Uh, whenever I cast a permanent spell with a mana cost that contains X, double the value of X. Yeah. It doubles all the X's. Flourishing. That's, that's cool. Would have been would have been cool. Wanna do it again? I made it. Yeah. Uh, eh? No. <laughs> oh, I guess, you know what? I don't have to put it on the bottom. It's a May. I can put it back on top. You, you can't. Ooh, what's up? <laughs> there it goes. Uh, Ben's learned his lesson about giving Brian cards. <laughs> Okay. Has uh, <laughs> I guess I could have looked at it before I did that. <laughs> what are you pointing at off camera there? Uh, the, the, oh, sorry. My command oh, is Rada. Rada are, uh, <laughs> Do you like to look at your top card? I just could have just looked at my top card. And I did not need to give, give Brian an extra card. It's so. making me super sad that like his mic didn't pick up his absolute unhinged <laughs> laugh just now because hearing it through my headphones from the other room was just... Oh, that's great. That's fantastic. Well, I'm gonna... Uh, ben, you I'm make going... me feel better about being a player that would do the exact same thing. Yeah, my, my pleasure. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna play Woodfall Primus. Just Ew. To the giant baddies. We're gonna blow up Domri. I think that's like the only target I can hit over there, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. The bird sacrifice was in vain. Okay, I'm gonna do some attacking. What kind of flyers you got over there, Brian? None. Okay. Uh, and let's see. What else? What else? Got a tapped so flyer. I could get cultivator back if I if you block my mold graph monstrosity. Oh, we so uh, big. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to attack with Kura and Moldgraph monstrosity. We're gonna go in with the elemental as well. Mm, you can untap some creatures on your turn, can't you? That's how the sequence of phases <laughs> in the game works, yes. These three, these... 
Kura. I'm surprised Wolf he didn't Rath. ask us. No, were we going to play where creatures untap at the beginning of your turn? <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Just no. an arbitrary rule. I don't know why people like it. <laughs> All right, um, I guess Xenagos will block the elemental since it's the same since the other guy has trample. Yep, yep. So it'll block and kill your element. Although you draw a card then, right? My mills, I think. From, from, I, I have uh, the option to mill. I have the option to mill three cards. Oh, it's mill three. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll just block that. And I take, what is it, 12? Uh, yeah, that's correct. Take 12. Ow. Do I want to mill? I actually, I don't want to mill, I think, because I like that card on top of my deck. So I'm gonna, gonna just going to let it not mill. And then I pass the turn. <laughs> hmm. I am not in a good spot here. Let's activate Duskwatch Recruiter. So look at the top three, reveal a creature, put it to my hand. I will take a Reclamation Sage. Does it do anything? Does it blow up the enchantment? Uh, it does uh, blow up an enchantment, yes. You don't have an enchantment in play now though, right? Uh, Olivia does. And that, which, which, which does that do? That's the, if I cast something out of exile, I can hit uh, equivalent mana value in the face if my commander's out. Okay. That thing is kind of scary. Yeah, for all the cards I've been casting from Exile this game. Listen, I'm at nine. One. I'm at 13 untapped mana. <laughs> I'm going to play Goblin and Archomancer. Wait, so are you... Oh, you didn't cast the Reclamation Sage yet. You just drew it. Yeah, just a hand. Okay. Does this work? Yeah, okay. We're going to do this this way. We're actually going to play... Uh, Draw a tree speaker first. It's gonna get haste. We're gonna level it up, and then we're gonna tap it for mana and play the Goblet of Narco. So just to give me access to more mana next turn, assuming I'm not dead. Yeah. Correct. And then I'm done. Okay. And I'm very likely gonna die. Oh no. <laughs> No, 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 no. Oh, dear. <laughs> All right. Uh... Ben's very scary. Help. Mm. Oh. oh. What's that? What's, yes. that? What's that? What's that? What is that? What is that? Hornet Queen. <laughs> flying Death Touch when she EGBs great for 1-1 one, one green insect creature tokens with flying and death touch. That's a lot. Peace. <laughs> 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 Love it. Ben, what do you have for blockers? For blockers? Yeah. Uh, I've got a 6-6. Six, six. I have a 6-6. Six, six. I have a 4-5 indestructible. I have a 5-6 indestructible, and I have a 3-3. Three, three. I also have Maze of Ith. Are the words flying or reach present? Nope. Bird for five. Okay, I will. You don't even to maze. Don't even, don't even waste your Maze of Ith. Wait, why, why would I? What's the, I it's going to give Brian a card, though, right? Uh, so I'll maze, I'll maze the... Uh, a card. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I have completed my turn actions. This is an interesting turn for me. Uh, I draw. Don't kill me, Ben. Don't kill me. I draw Unbound Flourishing, which we all. Whoa! Know. What? How lucky! And... All right. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna give you a freebie. You can look at your top card. Well, I can't. I can. I can look at my top card. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just letting you know. <laughs> oh, yeah, you are you. allowed to. I'm so, gonna give you this free. Wow. <laughs> Generous. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna play Unbound Flourishing. Okay. <laughs> the top part of my deck is a mountain, so I'm just gonna play that thanks to Rada or Kelvin. I look at the top part of my deck. Wow. I'm like running out of giant, horrible creatures. Yeah, to, he's going up against play. a pro and an idiot that sometimes makes things work for herself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, I think I should just do this. Maybe I did this in the wrong order. Oh well. Okay, I'm gonna play Green Sun Zenith again. I was gonna uh, say, isn't haven't you played that before? It, it gets when you part of the thing is it's shuffled back in, and I will I will cast it for I, don't know, I guess eight. I don't know. You get two green sun zenith for eight because of the unbound flourishing. Right? That's correct. So this is double double the green sun zenith action here. Oh, you're uh, you're doing it for four eight with the flourishing. Okay, got it, got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. No, it's no, no, it's, I, no, no I do it, doing it for eight and it double. I get two casts of it. Yeah. Okay, so that's what ahead. I thought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And then you have to shuffle the copy into your deck too. Yes, yes. Yeah, of course. Right, yeah. Naturally. <laughs> I know one of the cards I'm gonna get is Nick's Blood Ancient. Oh and boy. And I'm gonna get, I guess. These aren't being cast, they're being put, yeah? Uh, well, there there was a spell cast, and then there's a yes. god put in sack. So yeah, these are not cast. Okay, and I get Avenger of Zendikar. Ooh. Okay. I shouldn't have played the land. I should have. Played. Well, ha ha! Played the land. 
Miss Bay. Okay, so I get, I get like, I get a lot of plants. So I have 19 plants. Okay. It's hard to do stuff because there's so many things. Okay, I'm uh, Brian. Uh, oh. Hold on, do I die to Olivia? Yes. <laughs> I, mean, I, I died to both you guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cloth is triggers. Uh, yeah. Get rid of something in your graveyard, Olivia. And uh, everybody, oh. everyone take two, I gain two. I'm at seven? That's not nearly enough. Uh, <laughs> you have a lot of blockers, bro. I do, I do. You both do. Mm. And then like one of you, if I attack one of you, the other one just kills me, right? You, you have a million blockers. I don't know how I would kill you. I have uh, bees. Yeah, the he does have bees. Bees nuts. You can get you can get stuff back with your with your mold graph if they die to a bee. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna attack Brian with mold graph. Ow! Oh, I have a lot of mana available now. I have a lot of mana. <laughs> yes. What clued you in? I got guys. Guys, I have a lot of mana available. Uh, yeah, you have okay. 21 mana available right now. Okay, so. I wish Rada had trample. That'd be sick. If Rada had trample, imagine? it would be too easy to kill people with commander damage. So you hate that. <laughs> oh, so Ben does like commander damage. Again, no, no. Benefits no, I just wish that she had trample. Those are not, that is not the same. Okay, uh, Rada's coming for uh, Olivia. Okay. Woodfall Primus comes for Brian. How and large is good Godamus Rada? Rada's 3-3 three, three right now. And then- uh, Can you buff her by 10? Yeah, easily. Yeah, like just like without without question, no, it'd be so easy. <laughs> Barely an inconvenience. I guess I guess that's it. I need a bunch of blockers. So yes, these two coming for you, Brian. Woodfall Primus and Moldgraph Monstrosity. And, and Rod comes for those you. both trample, right? Oh uh, yeah, they do. Yes, they both do. Yeah. Okay. So how much total power is it? It is fourteen total power. Okay. So I need to block eight to not be dead. I will block Runic Armasaur and Xenagos for ten total toughness on those. I'll block Rada with a uh, giant. Okay, so that, I need a buff for Rada, is what you're yes. saying? Yes. So she gets plus a billion, plus a billion. Okay, so yeah, I'm at three. Now I'm going to... Wait, do, do my guys die? No, neither no. of them die. Okay, all right. Damn it. Maybe you should attack the person with the bees. <laughs> yeah, did. swing at the bees! I did. Okay, we'll I'm going to... Swing more uh, at the bees. I'm gonna. Um, Wait, Ben, they're just little bees. They're not that tap, bad. <laughs> just swat them I'm away. Tap four and use. I guess I can look at the top card. Oh no, my runic armor score. It's dead. Uh, I blocked with it. I'm gonna tap four. It's not a creature. I'm gonna put it in the graveyard. It's Court of Calling. And then I'm going to do it again. You sure you don't want to do this in combat before damage? <laughs> I just want parts from my runic armor score to die. <laughs> oh, every, oh, I see. I see. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking at the top card. Uh, it's like, what are we missing? No, nope, Brian just wants the advantage. All right, I pass the turn. I pass the turn. Okay, I am going to cast Sakura Tribe Elder. I am going to cast Reclamation Sage and Unbound Flourishing. Oh, damn it. That makes me sad. These are getting buffed by the Ogre Battle Driver currently. So then I'm going to activate Duskwatch Recruiter. I feel like Brian has schemes. Mm -hmm. It's like he knows how to play magic. Plants. Arguably, why even was good I, at it. Why was I worried about blockers? I forgot I have 19 plants. You've just made a whole garden there. I could have had a much better turn last turn. I really was, I could have played the land after making 18 plants. I'm gonna play Nylea. Uh, this also has the buff from Ogre Battle Driver. I'm gonna play Gaia's Cradle and Crater Hoof Behemoth. Oh, shit. So. <laughs> Uh, I have nine <laughs> creatures. Uh, this is my 10th creature, I think. So everything is plus 10, plus 10, that. and <laughs> I, I was like, you know, okay, I need to keep things alive for, for the cradle and behemoth in my head so I don't get <laughs> exploded right now. So these all have battle driver triggers as well. So mm -hmm. these have plus 12 power. Everything else is plus 10 power. I've made some, made some mistakes. <laughs> you do have the maze of myth. So clearly you should full send it, Ben. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely going to be full sending basically at Ben. I'm going to send some stuff at you because I think maybe I can kill you too. So we're going to have Xenagos. I suck at magic. I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> Xenagos is going to target Nylea, who is currently 17 power. So Nylea becomes 34 power. Nylea is coming at Olivia. Mm. Along with 
Xenagos. I, mean, I don't really want to do all this math. This is just a lot of math. How much total toughness do you have currently, Olivia? How could you ask that kind of question? Seven. So I'm trying to figure out how to kill you, and then everything else attacks Ben. That's the simpler question. <laughs> 29. Uh, okay, so yeah, these two coming at you, everything else goes at Ben. Okay, what's the okay. total power? The total power, that's a very good question. 93. Yeah, 93 power coming and at you. how much is coming at me? 50 coming at you. So I'm going to flash in Sweet Gum Recluse. <gasps> Sweet Gum! What's that do, what's it do? It's a zero three, but it has Cascade and Reach. And when ETBs put three one one counters on each of any number of target creatures that entered the battlefield this turn. So if I can cascade into a creature, I can buff it, but that's Also, it. if you if you cascade If you cascade into, into a three drop. If you cascade into the cast three, you can just kill me. <laughs> go for it. Two. Go, two, Olivia, go. Two, two. That's too many. Two. Thank you. Oh. It's a two. <laughs> but wait, 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 Olivia, Olivia. Oh, crap. How does it work? What? Can you cost anything off of the, whatever that card is called? Dire Fleet Daredevil. That's when the one. an ETB's exile target instant or sorcery card from an opponent's graveyard. You can cast it this turn, spend mana, though, or mana of any type to cast the spell. Oh my gosh. Can you can you cast something of mine and kill Brian with it? Maybe. It can only be, it can only be an instant because you have to cast it instant now. Yeah. yeah. Do you have. Damn it. I have Court a, of a, Calling. You, you can, have a one can, drop can you invoke, instant. Can you. Can you convoke Court of Calling? It has to be a one drop. This has Convoke. Oh! Yeah. So you could convoke your Court of Calling into something. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, because I have bees. <laughs> bees nuts! <laughs> this is really funny. Ben, let's do it. <laughs> so the, the Azuri's Predator is not in play. No. Right? That, that, that goes to the bottom of your deck. Yeah. I, are you shooting me or are you, are you shooting something else? Are you out of your mind? <laughs> no! <I> was, <laughs> listen! <sighs> okay, I'm at one. I'm at one. <laughs> so you can, yeah, if you just convoke for a, any Cascade creature, you can kill me. But then Ben Ben is just gonna kill you. So. Even just casting Court of Calling kills you, right? Isn't this- No, uh, it's, it's cast, cast from exile. exile. It's not casting it from exile, it's casting it from your graveyard. Or is it exile? Oh yeah, just casting the Court of Calling will kill me. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, so I die. Yeah. Oh my which god. Means, which which removes is... all of my attackers going at Ben. Yeah. I know, that's the problem. So, Are any of them first strikers? The <laughs> is, it a, is it a May? Can you choose not to kill kill me and, and somehow survive and let me kill Ben? This That's creature the... deals damage equal to that spell's mana value to target opponent. So yeah, so you, you could you. you could also target Ben. But you just that. die. You just die. Don't Maybe you die? If, if she gets something that keeps her alive. Because I'm attacking uh, her. This is 34, and this was 16, so it's 50. And what am what's I getting biggest... with Sword of Calling? <laughs> what's your biggest creature that's coming at me, Brian? The Behemoth, for sure. That one is 17 power. Okay. It is really funny when you get all this math, then I might just die before any of the attackers matter. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right. What does Court of Calling find? Any creature. Uh, with converted mana cost X or less. What was X? Whatever you convoke. Oh yeah, you can convoke everything. Oh, because I'll have to kill Brian in advance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll make it five, six. Do I have anything at six that's going to get me there? When is all this happening before I'm off? doing this. This is all happening before damage, though. We're, We're blocks? before blocks because I flashed okay, out okay. Sweet Gum Recluse. Right. Okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. That got us the dire fleet. That's taking the court of calling, and we're resolving court of calling right now. Gotcha. You can just kill me with court of calling, but I guess like the, the question is. I still need something yeah, out. Yeah. You need you need to beat Ben. Yes. Okay. So uh, I guess for six, I'll throw out a tolly. Okay. So are you killing Brian? Brian is dead. Yeah. So Ben doesn't need to block. Yeah. Okay. I'm dead. <laughs> you know, I, uh, I now tried. that that's over, now that that's done, I will say I could have survived your attack. Yeah, I, like I said, I didn't do the math. I am sitting here at three life. I gotta try something. <laughs> well, that was a pretty spectacular combat. What am I supposed to do now? <laughs> but again, it is incredibly it, funny that it's this big, dramatic, count out everything, yeah. do this, then it's just like, I, you die before damage, no one no one takes anything. Tolly and pray. <laughs> Olivia, you got a Tolly, just pray. Also, you shuffled your deck now, so maybe there's not a land on top. Yes, that would be delightful. Oh, don't forget okay, your so counter is off a sweet gum guy. So I'll make it a nine because it came into play. Okay, I will untap and draw and be terrified of everything. Like my heart is racing that that all just happened. <laughs> I mean, this is a pretty good 50th episode if I do say so myself. So yeah. good job, Gruel. Woo! Okay. <laughs> I'm just going to play and am now hellbent. Uh, Durnan of the Yawning Portal. 
which is whenever he attacks, which he can't this turn anyway, look at the top four cards in my library, exile a creature card from among them, put the rest on the bottom under any order, I can cast it, the spell has undaunted. Costs one less for each opponent, weird. Yeah. Oh darn. (laughs) (laughs) Only one opponent now. (laughs) Ben, do you have things with reach? No, I do have a flyer, I have one flyer, and I also have Maze of If. Okay. What are we doing if we're not going for it? I just not going do for it. it. I can't survive the plant onslaught if he attacks with every. Well, maybe I can. Mm, I don't think so. He's gonna have schemes and tricks anyway. Okay, Yolo. Mm-hmm. Just I only have one card in my hand. Just so I'm just know. gonna full swing. One. I know, but you're gonna draw stuff. You have mana, and you can shenan. I'm sure. I do. I do. I can shenan. Yeah, you can shenan. Tali on attack. I reveal Ren and seven. Plus one to reveal the top four cards of your library. Put a land card to build this way in your hand and the rest of your graveyard. Zero is put any number of land cards from your hand onto the battle. How, how much does it cost? Cost five. Okay, cool. Let's do it. And I'll play the tome as well. So I will hit you for nine. I guess I could have responded by milling myself. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, well. Oh, I get wolf tokens too. Oh, two, two wolfies. I screwed that up. Oh well. Well, so yeah. Actually, you I would got have had a lot more wolves. <laughs> I got a wolf last time too. I have one two-two wolf also tapped and attacking. Okay, is this is this everybody? I think so. Okay, what's the the giant hydra has trample? Is that right? Yes. Okay. It is and... twenty-two twenty-two. Okay, and then what? Then we have a five-five flyer. Three, three, nine, two, two, four, two. Okay, so I'm going to take six from the bees and the horned queen, I think. Okay. Uh, Pura is going to block the phoenix. Okay. Kalia Keen-Eyed will block, what's your biggest ground creature? The 22-22. Okay, well, this will, the, the, both these guys will get in there for okay. combined 11, 11 sucking of trample damage. Uh, what's your next biggest ground creature? Natali. Hey. He's, he's, he's got me with plants, yeah. No. Okay, I'm, I'm actually, I'm actually, you know, I'm just gonna untap your your trample uh, twenty one okay. thing. That's but that's a much better play. So to Tali, I'll double block with these guys, and then what's your next biggest creature? Three six. Wow, Ellie, yeah. Ellie came in too late to protect me from getting attacked. No, no. Good I girl. will next bloom agent will block that one, and then the okay. next one. The next one is a two or three, uh, Faldorn. Okay, okay, that Titania will block that one. And okay. is there another ground creature coming my way? Yeah, two more, a uh, two two wolf and a two one dire fleet. Okay, this one blocks the two two wolf and one of my plants will block the other one. All right, I believe that my so Kura dies. got through, I believe, so what? Sweet Gum had a six behind and then Faldorn got blocked by something with more than three yeah. power. Okay. Five five. Okay. Holly got blocked by the gods. So and I then take... this is probably gone too. Okay, so I take six. <laughs> yes. Okay, and one of my plants dies. Kura dies, and I get the giant spirit of all my lands. All right, so I got the initiative. So I search for a basic land card, put it into my hand to shuffle. What a great use of oh, my time. Ooh. Put it into my hand, I'll play it for a turn because we know it's there. <laughs> Shut up. All right, now the question is how much damage can Ben do? Do you have my Ren and Seven? Yeah. Do you want yes. to activate one of its powers? Yeah. Yeah. Minus three to get a, a creature with power and health is equal to the number of lands you control. Yeah, let's do that. With, with reach. reach. Yeah, sure. <laughs> That's what all the lands were for. Yeah. All right, now it's my turn, right? Yes. Okay. Can you get past five blockers? So I think the answer is probably my, yeah. yeah. Block my biggest stuff. How many lands can you put into play for your plants? <laughs> yeah. Uh, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, yeah, you I, you got this, buddy. I play land. <laughs> okay. <laughs> GGs. <laughs> GG. GG. <laughs> that was like turn and a half or whatever was uh. Ooh. Grueling. <laughs> really grueling. Yes. I love you. Rude. I'm sorry. I'm not. Uh, well, I am. Wow. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Hey, Ben. Yeah. Not bad for someone yes. who's bad at magic, self proclaimed. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's so complicated. It's so, and I'm doing all the commander damage math. You know, yeah. it's just so hard. Yeah, it, 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 oh, yeah, it's really, so it really much commander damage game. math. <laughs> my, my, my commander made a really big impact on the game, especially with commander damage, as he yeah. sat here the entire yeah, definitely. time. I think my commander, oh yeah, Feldorn did some damage. I did too, yeah. so it's not that yeah. big a deal. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, I shone too brightly and died too soon. But yeah, hey. you popped up, but popped up too fast. Oh, that's I. I like it. I actually don't no. mind being the problem early because then I just get to sit and watch. It's great. Fair, fair. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I get that. Man, your Feldorn deck did not behave today. It's like no. I did my one. You should have been happy with my performance the first time. You absolutely I obliterated know. See, everyone. I jinxed it. I should have just. Well, but see, I did it. I. I played it wrong so ah. the first time playing it correctly <laughs> right yeah we won't talk about that no i also it's won't okay. pop it up on the screen somewhere <laughs> for you to go and check out that episode but yeah <laughs> real friends help each other out and make us look as best as we possibly can of don't course. be Ailey. of course you guys should also help us out by clicking the things that make the dings and liking and subscribing and checking out our cool sponsors and being on the Patreon or just watching this and mocking me silently since I can't hear you chuckling at how I don't know how to play magic. <laughs> You'll hear me chuckle, but uh, you won't hear the rest of them. Also, <laughs> <laughs> don't forget to go enter the Cool Stuff giveaway to celebrate our 50th episode. Thank you once again, everyone, for watching, for supporting, for being absolutely rad. We love yes. it. And also, however you're celebrating, the holiday season, holiday, yeah. Christmas, Hanukkah, whatever, just there's a whole bunch of holidays. Happy yeah. insert relevant holiday to you here and to your loved ones. And I uh, hope we will see you again next week for more Elder Dragon hijinks.